how you remove a S10 center console. So the very first thing you're what you're going to want to do is make sure you have a 10 millimeter handy. In this case, I have a 10 millimeter on a adapter, and there are four little bolts on the inside of the console. You get them down in here as well. One, two. Come over here where the cassette player is. Uh, in this case, I don't have one. One right there, and then there's one right there. Now, what you're going to want to do is, for those of you that have the uh, S10 Blazers or the S10s with the cassette player, uh, you're going to want to remove the cassette player. Let's just simply disconnect it. There is a wiring harness, I believe, that is down in here. Alright, so, and then just to get the center console out, you just pull up on the back end, and then pull up on the front end, and pull the front end back. Slide the back end back towards the uh, back window here and it should come out and you clear the radio stack take it out come over here following those four uh, 10 millimeter bolts right there right there right there and right there they come out uh, fairly rough for me but it's just because um, you know it's a 17 year old truck there's really no telling what kind of stuff has been in here I'm not the original owners truck has had 14 owners in its 17 year lifespan, uh, which is about six months per owner, ironically. Uh, but yeah, you can see that these uh, got a little bit of corrosion on them. I'm not sure if that's just because of what's fell in between the center console, whatnot. Um, but yeah, this wiring harness, uh, you'll see this. This is just the uh, plug in for the cassette player, and it just kind of sits there freely. Uh, I would not recommend you cut this just because this runs to the wiring harness and it connects there which ends up running right up all up over here on top of the intake so you cut that you could run into some problems if you want to see the intake video um, make sure you check the channel I did a little video on these uh, you know $30 eBay slash Amazon intakes and if they're really good or not so make sure you guys check that out if you want to see more S10 videos, make sure you hit the active post notifications and uh, you subscribe. Anyways, that's pretty much all I got. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Just to do the installation process is a reverse of removal. You just put it in, slide a, take it in like this. The cassette, the front end, go down at an angle, and then you can lay the back end down just like that. The four bolts, you just go in, tighten them down. That's pretty much it. Um, I've got quite a few things coming along for the S10. Uh, you know, this is an S10 ZR2 with the wide stance. Uh, but yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the videos. Thanks for watching. And as always, see you guys next time.